Hey guys, welcome into the Parker Reborn channel. Today we're going to be playing Regiments Winds of Change, specifically the mode Warpaths. Now, Warpaths is the conquest mode of Regiments, and essentially you can only get it through Winds of Change. So, yeah, if you're interested in this game or you don't know what this game's all about, by all means, check the link in the description section below. I go over the different game modes, uh, settings, everything, okay? What you should be looking for. Now, in this mode here we are going to play as the u.s and we are going to play as the airborne division 82nd airborne number one i have a affinity for the 82nd airborne i think they are badass just putting it out there right now and also it is considered a harder start to a campaign as you can see over here um it says hard now I don't know how hard that's actually going to be. I will say I'm going to keep it on the medium difficulty. You know, some of you may say, well, that's not very whatever. I have not played a great deal of this game. I've I've gotten probably uh, 30 hours in the game now or 20 hours, something like that. Not 20 hours, 20 hours, something like that. But anyways, um, <clears throat> irregardless, I'm going to try this. If it ends up being too easy, then I will up it for the next time. Our stages are only going to be six. So that way we'll have six total episodes. Depending on your viewership and your likes, your comments, so on and so forth, that will determine how long I do this series or if we continue to do more series on this game. So to start this out, being that we picked the 82nd Airborne Division, I do need to focus on the strategy of of sneaking up on the enemy now we will be getting another division added however for starters what i did choose is i'm well what i'm going to choose is the escort mission compared to a defense mission now a defense mission as you would assume would be different points defend them escort is you have different points defend those points while a convoy goes across the map now if the convoy makes it all the way across you make you get more operational authority which allows us to get more units uh, be able to, you know, upgrade all these things in between our different stages. So for starters, what I would like to do is I'd like to go in here and look at our next division. The next division I'm going to choose right off the bat is going to be the Kansas division. Now, what we do know about our units for starters, in fact, let me grab that real quick. Do the call in there. Now, what we do know about our units right now is that we are more focused. We are more heavily focused on infantry, being that the airborne infantry come out of the Humvees here. Uh, we have the... Actually, the HQ doesn't have them either. But the main thing is here, we have we don't have a lot in terms of armor. The Sheridan is not crazy. Uh, the Sheridan doesn't have much armor. As you can see, the frontal armor at 4.4, not great. However, the cannon is pretty nice. Uh, it's just the range that comes into into play as well. Uh, at the with it being a 150 millimeter <clears throat> gun slash launcher, still not. It, it's this is a nice tank, but I feel like we're going to have to be more uh, strategic about getting a placement sh place shots on the side of vehicles. So um, besides that, we do have ourselves one artillery piece. We do have the Chaparral, and that is a a uh, AA defense. So, and then of course the Apache, gotta love the Apache, Humvee HQ, and our little tow missile here, which is going to help reconnaissance wise and as well as get some nice shots on the enemy. Now, the reason why I went with Kansas Division is because we do have the opportunity for anti-tanks, uh, these tow missiles on the M113s, really sick, really accurate, we can get some big kills. Again, a lot of strategy is going to go into making sure that everything is effective we do have the Airborne Infantry, four squads that we can drop on the field uh, with the Blackhawk. And then finally, we have ourselves the Cobra. Now, the Cobra, again, this is going to be something that um, we're going to add in with our Apache. Uh, I believe the Apache. Yeah, the Apache is definitely the better one. I shouldn't even have guessed that uh, or tried to have uh, said anything about it. Now, Operational Four Authority is at 15 right now, so we're going to go in as is. At what you see is what we get and hopefully we'll make enough money where we can come back and get more points specifically for the deployment phase now to the events we have oh, excuse me out of six total stages we have to figure out what we're going to do with these events we have uneventful uneventful we do have this one supply platoons cannot be deployed external supplies are not available that is very that is rough honestly 
Uh, allies, a group of allied forces will attack an enemy node at the beginning of the phase. That's really cool. So you get that support. I don't know, man. Ooh, this is a really rough. Uh, this is a rough one. I have all the ones I've seen. It might be the worst one that I've seen. Because we're going to need supplies. Let's go with uneventful to start. And uh, let's get into the mission. Okay, guys. So what we're going to do is we're going to have a setup where our... Sharp, sharp roll is over here in the trees. I don't have anything else protecting golf except for the static units that are already there. Um, we also have my hum or the airborne infantry with the Humvee. They are going to be dead center here, right off of uh, Foxtrot. Now Echo, I'm putting more emphasis by Echo, uh, just for the simple fact that we. If, if both points are right here, they're going to be cutting across. We can at least get some shots off on them. We can maybe stifle their, their advances if that if that's what happens. Uh, I do have the M125, which is the mortar team. He, they're going to be firing off at the units out there. I do have my HQ right here. Um, he's kind of he's kind of hidden there. But uh, he's going to give the bonus to all the surrounding areas, the bonus to uh, the surrounding units. And then, of course, another airborne infantry sitting right there. Now, in terms of going back here, I keep jumping all over the screen. Uh, I do have in... Let's see, where are you? Ah, yes, my Apaches. What's next? So, the Apaches are right here. They're going to be stationed right here by Kylo. We're just going to be waiting and seeing if anything comes up. I did end up adding the Sheridan here to Hotel. They're sitting off in the trees. Hopefully, we can catch people or some of the enemies with their pants down. All right, with that being said, I can add more units, but I'm holding off. I only have 100 resources. I could... Ah, I, yeah, we're just going to hold off right now because there's a good chance we're going to be pulling supplies out onto the field. So without further ado, let's get rolling. Yes, please, start it up. So... Yeah, this is pretty sweet, these setups here. Oh... Oh, we can lay it up. Here we go. Okay, soldiers are out. Hear a lot of explosions in the background. The anticipation of everything. Got to love this setup here. Some of these guys are... I mean, here, here's the thing. If the enemy does try to come in, if they do break the line here... We're going to have these guys hidden, where as soon as they come through the streets here, it's going to be over. Our HQ all set up, ready to go. And of course, our mortar team waiting, waiting to fight as well. Alright, the first trucks, I believe, have entered, yep. So here's our first escort. It's got a little hard on the back, what the hell? I didn't know that would even be a thing. But a little hard on the front too. Pretty cool. Um, oh, here's some more. Why are they so far out? That's cool. More hearts. For the sake of it all. Cool. Okay, well, let's speed this thing up a little bit. I don't want to hold everybody up here. We'll double up the speed, and we'll see what comes out for the attack. Again, I do have the option to bring in more units. I could actually bring in a Sheridan. I've thought about that for a golf. Uh, and even Echo would be ideal. We do have a lot in Foxtrot, which is less of a concern for me. But, um, but yeah, just for the sake of all of this. Look at the units coming forward, though. It's cool. I love this little cinematic deal where we can watch and see where they're going. Oh, we got our first units coming up. And what did I tell you? Delta. All right. So let's get our helicopters in here. Apache. Ooh. Artillery smoke. Ooh, they put some serious hell down on that point. Just as I suspected, though. My goodness. Well, they're running away, let's see. Oh, hostile fire, back up, back up, back up. 
we do not want to lose the Apache right away. Okay. I want you to put hell on... Oh, put hell on that. What are you doing? Why are they running so far forward? Dumb decisions. Dumb decisions. Go, go, go. That was a bad, bad deal right there. My goodness. He's going to have to resupply. Um... So, I don't know why he was running so far forward. I, he still has his rockets. Yeah, he's still got 25% main ammo. So I don't know what happened. He must have lost the ability to see stuff over there. Let's, um, let's get our Sheridan up here. Actually, I'm thinking we're gonna... We're gonna have to get the Sheridan, these Sheridans over here as well. They don't take Delta. That's pretty crazy. Okay. Like I said, he's going to resupply. We're going to slow this down just a little bit. I would like to actually... No, let's speed it up. i got to get these Sheridans. Man, oh man, oh man. Oh, oh, there we go. That's what we're looking for. Get them over on them. That's doing fine. HQ, they're fine. Zone lost. Nice shot there. It's lost right now, but we're giving them the business here. Okay, well that's going on. Let's, uh, how's the Apache doing here? Yeah, it's as good as it's going to get. we got to get him up here. Unit lost. Ooh, HQ. That one's ballsy of him. That. Oh, it's even better right here. We actually can. Oh crap! Run, run, run! Go, go, go! Get back! Get back! Get back! Usually, where there's one, there's another. So, we'll have him come back. He can come back into the fight in a second here. Oof. Man, our Sheridan took a real beating here. I think what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to, uh... Okay. Like that. Do I have room for any more? No, I'm going to have to have him come back. This is a long trek. That's the one thing I wish I did have my supply trucks for that. But, uh... I'm going to back him up just a little bit. Let's slow it down a little bit. I know it's been kind of crazy. Really, I, I knew that Delta was going to be the big issue. Delta was my biggest concern, and sure enough, that came to be. We're going to move out the Apache. It's going to be out here by Delta, and we'll probably hit these guys from the side. Actually, that T-70 might be the way to do this. It, they're, they are running across field Zone here, so captured. maybe... Okay, and our M125 is, is out of ammo, so we gotta bring it back. I really should have put that supply truck. Dang. That's, it is what it is now. So there we go. Um, we're gonna get, oh yeah, side shots on them. Cute. He's gone. Oh, man. Oh, it just missed. That's all right. Holy crap. Wow, they really were aggressive there. Wait for it. He's about to, he's about to blow up. Good. All right, move up, move up. Mortars. Let's take that out. I'm gonna double check, they got a ways to go. Patchy for the win. Unless something pops up that we're not ready for. Oh shoot, he can't see him. I think the game, I think one of the things that comes up is 
the game, if, if they, if, if you tell them to kill something and then they disappear for a second, then that's the result right there. Like, uh, oh shoot, yeah, he's being really aggressive, whatever that is. Recon. Okay, good. Let's see what we got, uh, says we're all good to go. We still have our main ammo, secondary is good. Let's pull him back for right now. Actually, hold up a second. There was artillery over there. Let's do some, uh, let's do some sneaky stuff. Escorts are doing great, man. They they haven't even been touched. I don't know why they're damaged, though. Like, why the hell is that damaged? Alright. Humvee under attack. Okay, that's what's up. If I knew for sure that I could cluster bomb right... Low threat. Ooh, I think it's right here. I messed that up. That's alright. This could be dangerous. We'll see what happens. Oh shit, shit, shit. Get out of there. Run. Yeah, we're gonna bring him back here then. Come on, man. Get out of there. Yeah, you need to. Let's come back and fix up for a second here. Looks like he's. It's getting entrenched. We gotta go back here, Sheridan. Get you. Get you here. Listening. Can these guys not see. You must see, and that's what I mean. They disappeared and came back, so I think they just drop orders, and so they take they they treat what you're asking them to do as um. Oh. I think what they're doing is they're treating it as if as if uh, you're just telling them to go to a position. Oh shit! That's not good. I don't have much choice here. Yeah. It is what it is. This guy's main ammo is about to be good, and go, 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 go. All right. Need you here. Gotta get that helicopter. F got the Apache fixed up there. It's gonna take a second. We are going to lose the area, probably. No, 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 no. That's what I need to take. Take him out. Prioritize that. Prioritize him. No. Prioritize. There we go. He's gone. All right. Hopefully we can stay alive just long enough here. What's next? All right, go. I'm gonna have to use you now. <clears throat> oh man, hurry, hurry, hurry! They're panicking. It's unfortunate. Five minutes remaining. Five minutes? Okay. Well, we'll see. This has not been my best episode, I'll tell you that. I mean, I, granted, this is the second episode, but I'm telling you, this could have been a little bit different. I should have done more to help Delta out. Um, I do not feel comfortable... Up, but come on now. Wow, they're running. They're running. Okay. I need you to come back here. Holy cow, we might be able to save them. Oh, yeah, there we go. It's probably loud when I get close like that, but that's just freaking cool. Fly, get out of there, get out of there. Yeah, 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 I know. Holy crap, they annihilated those guys. Oh, oh shit. No, you gotta get out of there. We cannot lose our helicopter.
Yes, that's what's next. HQ is by itself. That's terrible. <clears throat> wow, they really messed this up there. Okay. What the hell happened? I, I was only gone for a second, I thought, but... Reverse, come out of there, get out of there. Yeah, he's gone. No good. Zone lost. Yeah, no kidding. Let's get that all figured out there. Don't have a much I don't have much that I can that I can do here. Shoot, what is going on here? Oh the helicopter. Dang, that's terrible. Where is our, uh... Oh, he's just not close enough. Well, I'll tell you what, I probably... I should have put these guys over here, and I can admit that. We got two minutes left. We need to get you out of here. It's not worth losing you. What's going on? What is... Okay. I don't know what's going on there. I don't know what exactly is killing him, but it's time to move up, though. We need you. Losing Echo is unfortunate. It's not the end of the world. That's the nice thing, at least. I have you come all the way back here. Do we have anybody else on this side? We did lose Sheridan. The Sheridan, at least, but unfortunately, I shouldn't say at least. We've lost more than I wanted to. I didn't think it was going to be that bad, but... And unfortunately, they wrecked my other 82nd. What's going on here? So now they're attacking over there. Just got to be careful here. I'm surprised they haven't attacked yet. Shit. Come back, come back, come back. One minute remaining. Come on, get out of there. Get out of there! Wonder if there's a way to move fast. Well, if you would just... Golly, he's trying to fight while he's backing up, so we just lost our Apache. This has not been uh, ideal here. I could get the Cobra out there. We're about to win this. That was not the best showing. I can, Like I said, I... Sorry it ended up turning out like this, but this is why uh, this is why we're playing it the way we are right now. We're doing this for the first first go at it, at least with this. I, I didn't have this much problems last time I, I did a, an escort, but that was also like three missions in. A little bit more well-rounded group. Now, killing these guys is going to help us for more resources. Oh, shoot. You know what? Get out of there. Don't do that. Okay. Okay, it's over, man. Holy cow. Uh, 54 points. Victory points. Objectives controlled, 10. Uh, we did end up losing quite a bit at the end there. That was super unfortunate. One thing I do want to know what happened was the... Oh, where is it at? We ended up losing our 82nd. I, I moved them forward, but I didn't think they'd get totally annihilated. I don't know if it was... If it was artillery. Here we go. Yeah, T-72, which is kind of surprising because these guys are really good. If you get in close quarters or if you're within the town, the 82nd will absolutely eat tanks alive. So whatever happened wrong there, it is what it is. I do wish I could figure out why the Apache wasn't going fast. Like, he's fighting and just floating back, and it's like, man, just turn and get the hell out of there. Uh, don't, don't fight. Just get out of there. Uh, that's what I was hoping for. So let's go to the next phase real quick here. Okay, so we did end up getting quite a bit of authority points. We do need to fix up a lot of these guys. We lost more than I'd like. So starting out, let's get our, our uh, airborne set back up so they're good to go. Next thing I want to do is I want to... Man, Apache, it costs so much, but it restores the two units. So it's like we never lost our Apache. That's all set up. That's good to go. Um... The next mission is going to actually be an escort mission, by the way. So the next episode, we'll do that. Now, 
we can't upgrade this division not that i really need to right now but what i would like to do is get more deployment points so let's do that we'll go we got the 75 deployment points right there and then also i think I'm gonna add an engine mm. man we don't really need the supplies actually the supplies was fine tactical support would be nice but what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do the engineer support for this next mission um, everything else is about on par. I don't need to use the two extra authority points I could to restore supply. We don't we don't need to do that. Okay. Okay, so this wasn't the prettiest thing in the world, but we're back on par. We ended up getting more... We, we got... We're good with the engineer support. Pretty much where it was a wash. This last round was a rut wash. We lost more than I'd like, but that'll be fine. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this video, if you'd like to see more content like this, by all means... Don't forget to like, subscribe for more content like this. Well, it wasn't the prettiest thing in the world. However, if you did enjoy this video, please consider subscribing. Hit the like and uh, comments. What would you like to see next here? Um, with that being said, guys, I hope you did like this episode. I know it was a little bit hectic, but uh, hectic's good, <laughs> honestly. Uh, keeps you on your toes and stuff. We will bounce back. Obviously, we were able to pay for everything back, and uh, we're, it was more light, more than, more or less a wash. But this next escort mission, I think I'll just stick to my guns on what I believe we should have done, because I called it out through the match. I just knew, I knew that there was going to be a problem. Delta was going to be a problem. So, uh, with that being said, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe for more content like this, and I will see you in episode two.